So in this question, a gun mounted on the plateau 960 meter away from a edge as shown in the figure. This is the figure. So this is a plateau and gun is mounted at this place. Height of the plateau is 960 meter. So height is also given as 960 meter. The gun can fire a shell with a velocity of 100 meter per second at any angle. Of the following choices, what is the minimum distance OP? That is X. We have to find out this minimum distance from the edge of the plateau where the shell of the gun can reach. And in this case, we are given four options 480, 720, 360, and none of the above. Okay. So it is given that. So this is the plateau and let us suppose gun fires something like this and reaches this point so it has a initial velocity of u at angle theta and this is given as 960 and the height is also given as a 960 meters and we have this point o and this point p so we have to find out what will be this x this is the question. So let us see that let P be the let P is the point. on the plane point on the plane for the shell when it passes near to the edge nearest to the edge this point let us call it E when it passes nearest to the edge E for greatest angle of projection for the greatest angle of projection so it means the shell cannot hit within the region OP. It can hit only at the to the you can say right side of OP. So we have to find out what will be this X such that the minimum distance. So we can see that this implies so. In the region AP or rather we can say OP shell cannot hit so it means we can say that at X max will be equal to nothing but point OP so in this case in order to further solve it we are going to use the equation of the trajectory for the projectile. So as per equation of the trajectory for projectile it is given as y is equal to x tangent theta minus gx square divided by 2u square 1 plus 
टेन स्क्वेर थीटा सो एट पॉइंट ई कैन राइट एट पॉइंट ई पॉइंट ई वाई कोऑर्डिनेट विद इक्वल टू जीरो एंड एक्स कोऑर्डिनेट विद इक्वल टू नाइन सिक्सटी so substituting this equation we are going to get 960 tangent of theta minus taking g as 10 960 square divided by 2 initial velocity is given as 100 meter per second square per second rather and this will be 1 plus tan square theta will be equal to zero. So if you solve it, we are going to get this as tan theta is going to have two values. It is quadratic in tan, so tangent of theta is going to have two values. Three by four, or four by three. But we want this AP, or rather OP, is as small as possible. So for OP to be minimum, tangent of theta should be equal to four by three. We are going to again use the, this equation and substituting value of four by three. So we get y will be equal to four by three x minus ten x square divided by two into hundred square. Plus, this will be sixteen divided by nine is equal to zero. So, and we also know that x is nine sixty. Not equal to zero. My mistake. So y, okay, and y is in the negative direction, in the downward direction. So we can write this as minus nine sixty. This is minus nine sixty is equal to four times three x minus ten x square two into hundred whole square. And this will be coming as twenty five upon nine. This will be giving us a quadratic solution x. So x will be coming as one four four zero meters. Now we are going to find out what will be our AP. And that was the point of this. So you can say that this point AP will be equal to x minus nine sixty, and this is point A. Not AP, but AO. My mistake. Hmm. Okay. 
so this is given as x will be coming as this part so the total x is coming as 140 and it means this is coming as 1440 and we are supposed to find out only x part so we can write it here that x will be equal to total distance is 140 sorry 1440 minus and AO we already know is 960 so x will be coming as 480 meters so option number A is the correct option thank you